Hi, my name's Leah Travasso, and I wrote something on love. Love. How would I describe love? How would you describe love? Hmm, love. It's such a simple word, yet it can evoke so many emotions. I think about the age-old love described in 1 Corinthians 13. Love is patient. Love is kind. Love is not jealous, boastful, proud, or rude. It does not demand its own way. It is not irritable. It keeps no record of being wronged. It does not rejoice about injustice, but rejoices when truth wins out. Love never gives up, never loses faith, is always hopeful, and endures through every circumstance. Love will last forever. In fact, three things will last forever. Faith, hope, and love. But the greatest of these is love. According to Google, the English language has 171,146 words and 47,156 obsolete words. But I believe love is my favorite word of all. I remember the feeling of getting my first puppy when I was a little girl. My dad took me to this home and we walked in and there was a playpen full of puppies. He said, okay, go pick which one you want. I was in awe. I went and picked out this tiny little white poodle. We took her home and called her Pammy. I loved that dog so much. And then I think about the love I have for my family. There's nothing like it really to be accepted with all of our, our shortcomings. And then there's a feeling one gets when they fall in love. It's almost indescribable. Some loves last a lifetime and others do not, but that's okay. Because I remember a saying as a little girl, it was a quote by Alfred Lord Tennyson, "'Tis better to have loved and lost than to have never loved before." Isn't that so true? The next type of love is the love a parent has for their child. This is an incredible love. It feels as if your heart is walking around outside your body. Oh, to be human is such a beautiful thing. We get to love others and others get to love us. But it doesn't end there. This love that we experience on earth is only a glimpse of what is awaiting us in all eternity. Now that is something to be hopeful for. That is something to get excited about. That is something that makes everything that we go through in life worthwhile. This hope of eternity helps us to become better, better individuals. This is what love means to me. It isn't the end of the story. No, it's just the beginning.